Mostly Arms box is from the Netherlands. Go try it. The first stop on our trip through the Netherlands is Gouda, and we're not talking about the cheese. Mm. Well, we are, but not yet. Let's try that again. We are talking about the city of Gouda, named for the cheese Gouda, because it's widely known for Gouda. Did that make sense? No. No. The city took on the name back in the 12th century after the local cheese made the area, local cheese made in the area, gained popularity. The town itself later took on the name because they had a monopoly on all the cheese sales in the country. Luckily, that Daddy, monopoly is no yeah. more, so you don't need to fly to Gouda to try Gouda. You Daddy, can just crunch bait. into these I only had one. Thumbs up or thumbs down? Thumbs, thumbs up all around. Thumbs up all around. So you thumbs up all it around. Double drinks. Double drinks. Brad, did drinks. you like it? Blackout. Double blackout. Triple blackout. <laughs> Do you have any more to go there? Wait. To go where? Daddy, can you? Daddy, can you? Oh, oh, oh. Hey, how could you? <laughs> Daddy, can you get up like stairs again? Zeke. Zeke. Organic sea salt and pepper chips. Classic seasoning on a one of a kind spicy. chip. These salty chips may seem simple at first, but don't let the looks deceive you. At one point, they would have been a luxury item. Peppercorns used to be so costly in the Netherlands that locals started describing expensively expensive things as pepper or expensive as pepper. Thankfully, as trade developed, spices like pepper became a lot more accessible. But pepper chips this addictive are still as special as can be. Thumbs up, thumbs down. Those, are those spicy, guys? Thumbs up, thumbs down. Thumbs down. Thumbs down. Let's go. No. 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 Addie, will you try it, please? It's just a potato chip, that's all. It doesn't look like it. It was, I mean, it wasn't salty enough. But, yeah, it was, it was okay. Mommy! Hazelnut cream milk chocolate, Dutch cocoa which with hazelnut cream filling. This yum is about to teach you a lesson about deliciousness. But first it needs to teach you a different lesson about the Dutch language. You may look at this chocolate bar and think, oh that's cute, but there's actually more to it. The wrapper depicts the 1897 reading board that helped generations of Dutch children learn to read. It'll teach you Dutch names as well as the words for fire, lamb, and buck. Here's an extra Dutch word that you'll want to use. I'm not trying to pronounce that. It means delicious. Let me see it. Bakes. V E R R U K K E L I J K. Uh, Can I see it? Verucalgic. Can I see it? Thumbs up or thumbs down? Thumbs up all around. Thumbs up all around. Thumbs up all around. Bless you. Bless you. Cover your mouth with your Spice cookies. Possibly the coziest spice cookie ever. If it's your first time seeing the word speculus, you might be imagining old-timey eyeglasses. Nice Luckily, the, Le the Netherlands number one cookie is a whole lot tastier than spectacles. So they truly are a spectacle to behold. Their name comes from the Latin word speculum, meaning mirror, as the spice cookies designs mirror the stamp used to print them. These ones are just as cute looking Pepsi. as they are cinnamony. Pepsi. You don't need spectacles to see that. Not so they're not cinnamony. Ramsey, try it. It's a cookie. Is it yummy? Wait, Daddy, can you read what it says again? Make him jump into your mouth. Wouldn't that be so silly? Bingo. And bite his head off. Just, just like, just, 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 just,
Try and Razzy. Okay, make him jump into your mouth and bite his head off. Is it yummy? So is it thumbs up for you? Is it thumbs up for everybody? Yeah. Thumbs up, thumbs down, thumbs up, thumbs up. Caramel Stroop Waffles. Taste the original Dutch sensation. Did you know Dutch children are reported to be the happiest in the world? There are many potential reasons for that. Impressive infrastructure and top-notch education, to name a few. But we have a different theory. theory. It's not coffee. Stroop waffles. Back in the 1840s, local bakers used leftover cookies, crumbs, and caramel to create this childhood staple. Ready to try Netherlands' most famous cookie? Make sure to commemorate the occasion by posting a reaction video to your first bite. Go for it. Fruity candy cars, juicy strawberry, black currant, and cherry. Candy shaped like cars, it's a Dutch thing. The famous Dutch confectionery Auto Drop has been making these iconic car themed sweets since 1965. Their product lineup includes parking attendants, steering wheels, and of course, their best selling catalogs. We could go on about how they take you a long, juicy, chewy ride, but it's better just to let you go on a taste drive. Okay, Razzy, you want to try it? It's a thumbs down for me. Oh. You ready? Yes. That was just coconut. Go ahead. Milk chocolate coconut cookies. Crispy cookies decked out in chocolate and coconut. Fact, chocolate is amazing and should be eaten as often as possible. Also a fact, the Dutch agree. In fact, you won't find another country in the whole world that imports more cocoa than the Netherlands. We're talking 1.78 billion in cocoa a year. And they sure know how to use it too. Just try these super crispy, uber chocolatey cookies sprinkled with a generous helping of coconut. You'll want to eat a billion dollars worth of them all by yourself. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Well, honestly, who wants chocolate? I'll cook chocolate. No, there's some more left. They've all been promised to my stomach. Give those here, Josh. Oh, mom. Mom. Oh. Oh, mom. Mom, your children are begging you. Wow. Um, I'm begging I don't, you I don't think please. she could give it. We're I don't think she should give it to us because, because she begs us. Hey. We don't do anything. <laughs> Thanks, Eli. No, uh, yes, you guys will have more, but. No, you yeah, so oh, yeah. oh, Salted oh, caramel popcorn. Just about to ask. Thumbs up, thumbs down. Thumbs up, thumbs down. Maybe, maybe, maybe. There's a thumbs down for me. What? Thumbs up, thumbs down. It was a hard no. Two rocks, Coca. Thumbs up. Yeah, why do you think I'm not going to eat the rest? Thumbs up. If it was good, I would have eaten that whole box. Right? Thumbs up, thumbs down. Yeah, why do you think I'm not going to eat the rest? If it was good, I would have eaten that whole box right then there. Really? No, I loved it. It was amazing. Oh. Oh, thank you. Second time in a row. Oh, a in a row. Oh, 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 Ready? Yeah. Try it. Nope. Wait, you 
Yeah, why do you have four? Josh, did you try any? Sausage caramel popcorn. No? Yeah. I made, I made, Sweet, I, I puffy, made with a touch one. of salt. It's no secret that caramel is an all-time favorite sweet in the Netherlands. From the iconic caramel spilled Stroop waffles to Holland's famous Hopi coffee caramel. The Dutch can't get enough of this stuff. But what happens when you want caramel and also want a salty snack? You throw that sweet, sticky goodness on popcorn. Add a healthy dose of salt and call it a day. The innovations never stop. Well, I call it healthy dose of salt. Add an unhealthy dose of salt. <laughs> well, I call it a healthy dose of salt. Don't be headed to whole bottle. <laughs> Thumbs up or thumbs down? That was really good. Also, the dog you wanted the popcorn. That was scary. Oh, good. Everybody like this? Except for Addy. Addy, thought it was thumbs up? No! You said you didn't like Whatever. Okay. I can't keep up with this. Can we all get one more? Salty licorice balls. The Netherlands' most popular candy. When it comes to candy, the Dutch are positively obsessed with licorice, especially the extra salty type. The flavor appears regularly in everything from ice cream to liqueur. But there's no oh, doubt no. that the most popular version of the simplest candy oh. form. No, Ramsey. Warm, the Dutch staple is hotly debated in many yeah. other parts of the world. Even our staff went to war over whether this candy was amazing or not. In fact, the passage is currently being written from under the desk. Safe from ensuing food fights. Please send help. Yeah. Right. Please send an ambulance. Yes, none of you like. Okay, it. that was a thumbs down for everybody. I'm assuming. Give me a plate, Belle. What did you guys not like about that? Everything. The powder in the middle. Literally. The middle and the outside. The it was taste. Oh, disgusting. <laughs> the feeling in my nose that made me want to sneeze. And everything. Yeah. Yeah. The feeling. Cappuccino pralines, chocolate truffles filled with coffee cream. We already know that the Dutch are prolific chocolate lovers, but what about the perfect drink to accompany the perfect dessert? That honor goes to none other than coffee. In fact, the Dutch are some of the biggest coffee drinkers in the world, ranking number five in yearly consumption. We're talking 19 pounds a year per person. So it's only natural to combine their two great loves into one bite-sized delight. We can easily see ourselves eating 19 pounds of this coffee chocolate. How about you? Yeah. Mm -hmm. yep. It's just chocolate. I like it. One day. Mm -hmm. Do you want to try it? Can I try a little piece? Can you smell it? Mm -hmm. It smells yummy, doesn't it? Mm -hmm. Here. Mm -hmm. It's super good. Mm -hmm. good? All right, go sit down. That was fun. There's a thumbs up for all of you guys. Yeah. Cheddar and onion crispies. Little crackers with big cheese flavor. Did you know that only 6% of the entire Dutch population is lactose intolerant? It's a good thing that number is so low because cheese is a huge part of Dutch culture. From pancakes topped with cheese to pea soup topped with cheese. To be super tasty crackers infused with cheesy goodness. The only thing that could possibly make them better, topping them with cheese. Guys, is it a thumbs up or thumbs down? Thumbs up? Okay, Eli said thumbs down. I'm in the middle with it because the initial taste is weird. The aftertaste is not that bad. Potato hips. <laughs> Do they have hips? Thank you. Provincial chips. Dutch French fusion at its finest. Surprised to see French on a bag of Dutch potato chips? So were we. That is until we found out that food from the Netherlands is positively bursting with flavors and influences from all over the world. Seriously. There's Ridgstenopel, a Dutch take on Indonesian food, tons of meat and cheeses brought over from Germany, and of course, these crispy potato chips seasoned with the classic French herb blends, Herbs of Provence. 
We should be saying Snake Lick. Etten or Bone Appetit. Bone Appetit. It's salty. Ari, uh, do you like it? Is it Eli? Do you like it? All right, thumbs up for everybody. Over here, anyway. What about you, Josh? Thumbs up, thumbs down, thumbs up, fun around. Milk Chocolate S, a super sweet holiday snack. Celebrating the holidays in the Netherlands, get ready to eat your words or at least your letters. During Sinterklaas Festival on December 5th, locals with Locals exchange chocolates shaped like the letter of the recipient's first name. We would have to customize this letter just for you, but since that would have been a logistical nightmare, we decided to go for S for super yummy. Why didn't they go for U for universal yums? <laughs> Why didn't they go for S for super sweet? That's or W for we. <laughs> Why didn't they go for Y for yum? Ew. Coated in warm Dutch cinnamon. These cookies are full of sugar, spice, and everything nice. That's because between 1640 and 1796, the Netherlands enjoyed control of the world's largest cinnamon supplier, Ceylon. Even though the honor now goes to Sri Lanka, the Dutch taste for cinnamon is still going strong. You can consider these buttery cookie sticks tasty proof of that. They're completely coated with warm cinnamon sugar, making them the perfect complement to tea or coffee. Thumbs up for them, Sam. Thumbs up all around. <laughs> Milk chocolate and caramel shroop waffles. The Dutch classic for chocolate lovers. Before painting his masterpiece, The Starry Night, in 1989, Van Gogh painted the much lesser known Starry Night over the Rhone in 1988. That's kind of how we feel about this yum. It takes the basic concept of a stroop waffle, soft waffle, gooey caramel, and enhances it with a slathering of melt in your mouth chocolate. Take a bite of this chocolate masterpiece and see if you can agree. Starry Night was not painted in 1989. Does that have Ninja Dad? 1889. <laughs> when did they say? 1989. <laughs> take a bite. Go ahead. Oh, well, take the one bite that you have. Frosted Egg Biscuits, crispy cookie with a touch of vanilla. Don't let the name fool you, these crunchy cookies don't taste like eggs at all. Some word literally translates to egg cake, but they, but they can take on both the fluffy cake texture you might expect, as well as this crispy cookie form. Light buttery with a touch of vanilla, they're eaten as everything from breakfast, lunch, or as a late night snack. Don't know about you, but we plan to eat them for every meal. I need a zap. I go boom. You don't even ounce it. It's recording that entire time. Black currant soda, the Dutch's favorite drink. If you assume purple meant grape, then think again. In the Netherlands, purple typically represents black currant. And arguably, the best way to enjoy this unique fruit is in the form of this super popular Cassis soda. You go into any shop from Amsterdam to Hague, and you're bound to see this classic soda brand lining the shelves. Sweet, lightly fruity, with a lightly with a lighter fizz than you may be used to and only a slight alcoholic content, we say this refreshing drink is our black currant favorite. Are you done? Did you not hear me? No, what? <laughs> slight alcohol content. Oh my God, are you serious? No. Oh. oh. I was gonna say it was like good that we gave the kids that. <laughs> Wait, why are you so angry with me? Mom, look at this. 
Oh, you don't like Momo. Oh. I, I eat all of them. I eat all of them. Let's be free. What's going on? Got the camera. Thumbs up or thumbs down? You all liked it? Everybody liked it? Yeah. I no, did not. I mean, yeah, okay, I was in the middle then. Uh, Cuz it was weird, but it was also liquid. And liquid is good for you. Bye. 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 Watching children eat food, which is really creepy. Like, <laughs> like watching <laughs> children eat food. If you like watching children eat food. That's I will sneak weird. into your house as a ninja. I think you should like the subscribe. Let the kitty like and subscribe. Uh, There's no kitty like and subscribe. Like and subscribe. Hit the like and subscribe. Like and subscribe.